Hi folks, so this is what I've been up to lately. This is my FreeNAS um, server. It's in a Fractal 805 case and it's very nice. It's very much bigger than I thought, but it can hold um, 10 drives quite nicely. Currently have 10 drives in there. Um, it's all configured to RAID um, ZFS at the moment. And I'm trying to get the best out of it. So I bought this little doohickey. <coughs> doohickey. It's a crikey, what's it called? A micro, <laughs> um, a micro tick, um, ten gigabit router stroke bridge stroke jobby thingy. Now I am a complete noob when it comes to this kind of stuff, but I bought this just before these four ports. That's currently connected to uh, ten gig Ethernet, as you can see. Nothing special there, but it's it's so powerful. It can do so much stuff that um, it's opened up a whole new world of nerdism for me. But it's com I'm completely out, completely out of my depth. I I'm trying to read stuff on the internet, but there's nothing. The trouble is, it's too much information, but it's not laid out in a format for beginners. Really, I'm trying to figure out how to make this um, using. TFTP and DHCP talk to the FreeNAS server so I can boot and install Windows um, installations and potentially completely run um, diskless uh, PCs off the FreeNAS server. So this is where I am at the moment, this is where I'm getting at. So I've got Oracle VM. Um, Running and it's configured to uh, where well, system to boot off um, the network first and no other hard drives. Um, storage wise, I've just got a really simple five gig <coughs> virtual disk, nothing special. Uh, but the point is, it's supposed to boot off Pixie. So this is the root of the um, TFTP server or folder. And I have no idea what I'm doing. I should chuck a whole load of stuff in there I was told to and none of it's working. But let me show you what, what happens when I start the VM. And starting do 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 starting with that there. All good. Pix iPixie starts up. Finds the link. DHCC DHCP okay and boom. Unable to locate configuration file. And I don't know what configuration file I'm supposed to get. Anyway, hope you can help. Ta for now.